construction is well on its way in the heart of London. Rico Hoist has installed a common tower on Canary Wharf for the construction of a 240-meter high-rise residential building. Using a common tower, six large hoists can be operational at the same time. This way, personnel, equipment, construction materials and waste can be transported up and down at high speed. It also allows for the hoisting of large prefab components such as full bathrooms, cladding panels and window frames with quick and easy access to all floors. This is our 5x5 five five common tower. On this, we've got a twin hoist on the right hand side and a twin on the left, followed by a big mammoth hoist, again for the bathroom pods. With the twin on the right hand side, this gates are feeding every other level, just to stagger it, just for the more personnel to make that more of an express lift. Again, on the Mammoth, as you can see, you've got a full clear distance, so you can actually get the bathroom pod straight into the building quite nice and easy. On the left hand side, you've got a twin. These machines are mainly for materials as well. These will be serving every single floor. And again, the main items of this is what don't go in the Mammoth hoist. We can actually feed with this material hoist itself. Again, all the common tower, the actual mammoth itself is tied straight for the aluminium structure and these are back to the ties into the building itself with full edge protection all the way around. As you come around to the building, what we've done in this actual plot itself, we've staggered the ties on each different level. This allows for a temporary casting socket to actually move the ties into a temporary location so the cladding panel can be infilled. Again, this keeps the machines working all the time to keep no loss in production on the building itself. Again, and then we get the full ramp into the building. Eventually, this plot itself, when they actually come up with the cladding, they'll start putting this tie into the temporary position where the temporary casting socket's been allowed for, and the cladding panels will be installed, and then back into the actual main tie position itself. And again, this will actually get this block of flats completely filled in. With a common tower, the hoists are tied to the tower rather than directly to the building, which means cladding and fit-out can start with the hoists still in place. This is a major advantage over the traditional situation where multiple hoists occupy much more of the building's open face. A common tower gives increased headroom so that cladding panels can be fitted as soon as a floor has been constructed. When the common tower gets dismantled, only two small panels of approximately 20 by 60 centimetres remain to be installed on each floor. This protects the floors from wind and rain at an early stage and allows for completion of the fit-out of lower floors as construction continues on the main building above. For more information, visit ricohoist.co.uk.